All right, so D'Amico Ryans is now the head coach of the Texans, and he's going to try to bring some of the 49ers staff with him. Early indications are that Bobby Slowick, 49ers pass game coordinator, has been so important working with the team's quarterbacks. He's a top candidate to be Houston's offensive coordinator under D'Amico Ryans. But perhaps even more interesting is this whole Chris Kacarek situation. We all know that Chris Kacarek is one of the keys to the 49ers' success, has been one hell of a defensive line coach for them. It seems that Houston is interested in poaching him from the 49ers. Maybe as a DC, I'm not exactly sure based on the reports and the talk that I'm hearing where D'Amico Ryans would want Chris Kacarek, but I do know that the 49ers consider it a priority to keep Kacarek. They really, really want to keep him because they understand he is a straw that stirs the drink. He is a guy who's scrounged so much value out of that defensive line since 2019. And go back to Kyle Shanahan's press conference the other day. He talked about wanting to maintain continuity on the defensive side of the ball. It's probably one of the reasons why the 49ers did not hire Vic Fangio. Fangio obviously runs a slightly different scheme, 3-4 versus 4-3. I get it. That's probably reconcilable. But the bottom line is that Shanahan wanted the defense to stay the same, operate the way that it has since 2019. And... The big thing that happened in 2019 is Chris Kacarek showed up and started running the wide nine. So according to Aaron Wilson, who covers the Texans, uh, the 49ers are really prepared to sweeten the pot to keep Chris Kacarek in San Francisco just in case this po poaching effort from D'Amico Ryans gets a little bit more intense. And they could sweeten the pot with more money. They can sweeten the pot with a higher title. I'm not sure if they would make him their defensive coordinator if the 49ers would do that, but maybe they can make him some kind of senior coach. I don't know what would, I don't know what would uh, make Chris Kacarek happy enough to stay, but I do know that the 49ers are going to be trying to do it because Chris Kacarek is really, really important to them. So stay tuned because this is going to be a big part of the news cycle. 49ers really want to keep their top-tier defensive line coach. He might be the best D-line coach in the NFL.